Chapter 1, verse 1 says, This is a letter from Simon Peter, a slave and an, an apostle of Jesus Christ. I'm writing to you who share the same precious faith, faith that we have. This faith was given to you because of the justice and fairness of Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. May God give you more and more grace and peace as you grow in your knowledge of God and our Lord Jesus. By his divine power, God has given us everything we need for living a godly life. We have received all this by coming to know him, the one who called us to, to himself, by means of his marvelous glory and excellence. And because of his glory and excellence, he has given us a great and precious promises. And these promises are the promises that enable us, enable you to share in his divine nature and escape the world's corruption caused by you evil caused by human desires. In view of all this, make every effort to respond to God's promises. Supplement your faith with a generous provision of moral excellence and moral excellence with knowledge and knowledge, self-control and self-control with patience and patient endurance and patient endurance with godliness and godliness with brotherly affection and brotherly affection with love for everyone. The more you grow like this, the more productive and useful you'll be in the knowledge of our Lord Jesus Christ. But those who fail to develop in this way are short-sighted or blind, forgetting that